tuning in to Celeb Source. Now today we have Boosie starting fight clubs, 6 ix release date, Jay-Z decisions, decisions, Osiris seeing stars, Trina talking reckless, and Kanye finally makes his move. Thanks for tuning in to Celeb Source. If this is your first time to the channel, please be sure to like and subscribe and join our notification game by hitting that notification bell somewhere on the screen so you can be up to date on the news that matters to you. Now, taking our top spot for today is Lil Boosie, who, if you asked him what he thinks about the UFC, his response would probably be something along the lines of, that bit is not all that, and I'm mad. Because I've been bucked up about this bit. This bit regular. I don't give a what about what no nigga say. This bit regular, man. I know, I know. You're probably mad. But Lil Boosie will be starting his very own fight tournament called Across the Tracks where street fighters will be able to participate and fight against each other with matches ending after a contender has been knocked down five times or completely knocked out he said just so folks don't you know just to make sure is for real for real now if you think that's insane it gets better Lil Boosie himself who dropped the album today will be the commentator of the street fights of all time Lil Boosie states that it will be five fights in each city $1,250 a piece is currently in the works and we look forward to seeing that in the near future. Now, Lil Boosie also takes our number two spot because it's Lil Boosie as well. Today for his comments concerning NFL quarterback Drew Brees of the New Orleans Saints who stated in response to a question about kneeling during the national anthem, Drew Brees stated, quote, I will never agree with anybody disrespecting the flag of the United States of America or our country. Close quote. Which not only hit a chord with many people, but turned Boosie into the human torch who went full on flame on and roasted the quarterback by not only saying that he would see supporting the player, but based on the picture that he took with Donald Trump and Melania, he needs to check his wife's DMs implying that Trump was eyeing Drew's wife. In fact, Boosie said on the gram, quote, damn, at Drew Brees, you show your true colors. You let me down, bruh. The black community is a big part of your career, mother effer. Look, I'm going for the Falcons when they play Saints. I still ain't put Gucci back on yet. So as long as you quarterback, I'm not supporting the Saints. You were so happy in this pick. It was a pick of uh, Drew Brees sitting next to Donald Trump and Melania. I know Trump was eyeing your wife that that uh, giving. My, I know Trump was giving your wife that eye. Check her DM. He's probably in it. Trade him. Trade him. Trade him. Trade him. Trade him. Close quote. The nerve of him won't disrespect the cloth, but he gonna disrespect the people. It's only fair to mention. That Drew did apologize for his remark, but three quarters of his back was already toast. I know there's not much that I can say that would make things any better right now, but I just want you to see in my eyes how sorry I am for the comments that I made yesterday. I know that it hurt many people, especially friends, teammates, former teammates, loved ones, people that I care and, and respect deeply. That was never my intention. I wish I would have laid out what was on my heart in regards to the George Floyd murder, Ahmaud Arbery, the years and years of social injustice, police brutality, and the need for so much reform and change in regards to legislation and so many other things to bring equality to our black communities. I am sorry and I will do better and I will be part of the solution and I am your ally. And I know no words will do that justice. That's gonna have Mark. to be it. But three quarters of his back was already toasted. Now, in case you were wondering what's going on with 6 9 because I know it was in the back of your mind, Takashi 6 9 has once again delayed his video from June 5th to June 12th, stating 
that he wanted to be sensitive to what's currently going on in the country, which appears to continue the string of good decisions that we've been seeing from 6 9 It's also significant to note that his girlfriend stated that he should be released from house arrest soon enough when she posted a pic of herself with the words, quote, house arrest day number 627, 57 more days, close quote. I couldn't help but think of her as the person wrapped in pillows being a punching bag for 6 9 If you don't know what I'm talking about, you need to check out a video uh, with 6 9 calling out rappers for boxing. And then, thank me later. But, I do think it would be safest if 6 9 himself remained in quarantine mode a little bit longer. I wouldn't want anything unfortunate happening to the young man. Now, on Instagram, 6 9 did post the following, quote, music video will be pushed back to June 12th out of respect for what we're going through right now. And then he additionally added, it's not time for a music video right now with everything going on in the world. It would be extremely selfish. June 12th, next Friday, with the praying hands emoji. See, the man does have some sense. Now, Jay-Z is known for making shrewd business decisions. You're like, wait a minute, this sounds familiar. That general, that Jay-Z's piece of the net was approximately $350,000. You're like, a piece of the net and his company working in the best interest of the players will create um, a bit of a conflict of interest next for having a boxing match with YK, young kid, YK, Osiris, who promptly saw stars when he decided to box Blueface on the roof of the football field at Blueface Craig. Now, social media has expressed its disappointment at the hand skills displayed by both fighters before going back to their far more exciting game of Sudoku which was much more exhilarating with all the numbers and the empty boxes. Trina, Trick Daddy Trina, has played herself by coming out the house and calling protesters animals on her radio show with Trick Daddy. Yes, you heard me. She called them animals in a move that has probably doomed not only her career, but any sense of validity that any statement she makes on social issues could have in the future. Social media appropriately responded to her comment with statements such as the following, quote, to refer to your own as animals is so despicable. Thank you for the memories, Trina, but good riddance to you and black celebs like you. Y'all are failing us close quote they need to make the curfew at 6 p.m to 6 a.m that's how i feel <laughs> no keep everybody off the street these animals off the streets that are running around in miami Dade county acting like they have escaped from a zoo lock them up at 5 p.m so the streets can be nice and clean that's how i feel that means tear up our city Ain't nobody tear up no city. That means tear up our, that means run through and tear up our stores nobody, and burn down our stuff nobody, and break in our stores. Okay. I don't approve okay. of it, period. Okay. I don't approve I don't of it, period. You're talking about black lives. All right. The, All the right. black That's lives matter. that matter, right? The same black mm -hmm. lives that are taken from the hands of other black people. Those are those oh, matter too, huh? I, All y'all fake for the protests and the fake. Oh, we so concerned about George Floyd. It half of y'all not marching. I'm not even caring about this man. People are just doing First maliciously. All, everybody. Everybody wasn't looting and burning up stuff. Mm -hmm. When the police get behind you and the red and blue lights come on, you're not supposed to be scared. You're not supposed to be scared. Really, Trina? Yeah, we heard the interview and uh, it's, it's quite a thing. Matter of fact. Now, finally, many have been wondering where exactly is Kanye West amidst all this? Some even show delight in the fact that he has not been very vocal during this time, knowing that he has often placed his foot in his mouth whenever he had something to say on social issues. Well, Kanye West has been very quiet in the past few days, but this may be due to the fact that he has been amassing funds to help take care of the families of George Floyd, Breonna Taylor, and Ahmaud Arbery, and also by giving them $2 million 
salute Kanye to take care of their legal proceedings. All right? Again, salute to Kanye who thankfully did not use words but spoke through his actions. Let us know what you think. If you had a chance to sit down with Trina, exactly what would you say to her? Let us know in the comments below. Be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. Thanks for tuning in to Celeb Source, your source for celeb news.